SC OptiCam Pre-Polished Connector Termination Demo. Place the SC OptiCam connector cradle into the OCTT. Verify that the cradle is in the forward position. The tool comes with the cradles required to terminate OptiCam series connectors. Make sure that the laser switch is in the off position and attach the included OCTT patch cord to the connector on the OCTT. Place the SC OptiCam connector in the cradle, making sure that the tabs on the connector housing are between the forks on the cradle. Attach the other end of the OCTT patch cord to the ferrule on the OptiCam connector. Squeeze the clamp arms to open the fiber clamp pads. Gently insert the stripped and cleaved fiber into the inner housing assembly until it stops on the fiber stub. Lay the fiber down between the two open fiber clamp pads and release the clamp arms to clamp the fiber in place. Next, shuttle the cradle holder to preload the cable, assuring optimum contact between the field fiber and the pre-polished fiber stub. Now turn on the tool laser by toggling the power switch to the on position and observe the amount of glow at the cam lever. Activate the connector cam by rotating the cam lever completely. Any glow at the cam lever will diminish to indicate proper termination. Turn off the tool laser by toggling the power switch to the off position and remove the OCTT patch cord from the connector ferrule. Squeeze the clamp arms and carefully lift out the terminated connector assembly from the connector cradle. Release the clamp arms and reset the cradle holder by sliding it away from you. Assemble the SC OptiCam connector by pushing the boot forward against the flange. Push the inner housing assembly into the outer housing assembly until it snaps into place. The OptiCam connector can be re-terminated if necessary to improve optical loss performance. This results in lower total installed costs and reduced scrap. To re-terminate the connector, remove the outer housing and slide the boot off of the connector. Now, uncam the connector by rotating the cam lever all the way back and remove the fiber. Then, repeat the termination procedure from the beginning.